Go on, girls. As I was saying about the Laird and his brother, all summer they'd upheld their oath to avoid the touch of woman. Yet here before them stands a fair maiden in need of their help to cross the river. The Laird doesn't miss a beat. He hoists her onto his shoulders, carries her across, sets her down, doffs his cap, and fords back across to his brother, who is dumbfounded, can't even bring himself to speak. The day stretches on, the Laird carries on hunting, and his brother quietly gnashes his teeth down to powder. Finally, the dam breaks. Brother, he cries, how could you do it after everything we've sacrificed? How could you break your vow like it was nothing, carrying that lass on your shoulders like you were a Shetland pony? The Laird just smiles. Brother, I sent that lass down across the river. You carries the still. <laughs> oh, I got a chuckle. A rare day indeed. I need to know you'll be okay without me. Atreus. I am sorry. Don't be sorry, Father. Be better. Let's go home. <laughs> 